and the winner is Menarini India Private Limited. Woman Entrepreneur of the Year 2013 and the nominees are Dr. Ruchi Das, Founder of Health Cursor Consulting Group Ms. Bina Ramani, CEO NCE Life Sciences Dr. Prathima Radhakrishnan, Medical Advisor IMA Fetal Care Dr. Nilgini G, Founder CEO Blue Skin Cosmetology Ms. Kavitha Ayer Rodriguez, Founder Director, Thermite Nova Biologics Private Limited. And the winner is from Blue Skin Cosmetology, Dr. Nilini Ji. I invite Chaitra to receive the award on her behalf, please. Until expired, until expired. Yeah, please come. come. CEO of the year 2013 and the nominees are Mr. N. Govindarajan, Managing Director, Aurobindo Pharma Limited Mr. Subhanu Saxena, Managing Director, Sipla Limited Mr. V.K. Singh, CEO RPG Life Sciences Mr. Sanjeet Singh Lamba, Managing Director, SI India Mr. Rehan A. Khan Managing Director, Abbott India Limited. And the winner is from Abbott India, Dr. Rehan Khan. Can I tell my production guys, we have to repeat this video because he is on his way to come. Okay, right. Yeah, the next nomination please. India's most admired company in corporate governance 2013 and the nominees are Sun Pharmaceutical Industries Limited, Cadilla Healthcare Limited, Dr. Reddy's Labs Limited, Aurobindo Pharma Limited, Glenmark Pharmaceuticals Limited. And the winner is Aurobindo Pharma Limited. Can you the next one, please? We don't inform the announcers. Brand of the year 2013. And the nominees are Dolo, Corex, Taxim, Boverand, Dexo Range. And the winner is Dolo.
Next one, please. Rising Brand of the Year 2013. And the nominees are New Bonner, Acumentis Healthcare Limited, Odisseth, Galfer Labs Limited, Viva Das Saroop, Catchit Farmer, Tripad, Micro Labs Limited, Januvia, Glenmark. And the winner is. Start clapping. This new boner. Nomination, please. India's most admired pharma company 2013. And the nominees are Cipla Limited, Alcom Laboratories Limited, Sun Pharmaceutical Industries Limited, Glenmark Pharmaceuticals Limited, Pfizer India Limited. And the winner is Alchem Laboratories Limited. The next nomination, please. Uh, just, yeah, Mr. J.P. Singh has come. Yeah. Can you have the lights, please? Yeah. Please be here on the end. Please be here. Uh, he came late actually. Uh, can we please run the company of the year, please? Can we have the trophies? Company of the year, yes. Galfa Laboratories Limited. Galfa Laboratories Limited. Can you have the next nomination, please? India's fastest growing pharma company 2013. And the nominees are Galantic Pharma India Private Limited, Ami Life Sciences Private Limited, Menarini India Private Limited, Irene Healthcare Private Limited, Pegasus Pharmaco India Private Limited. And the winner is Menarini India Private Limited.
next combination, please. India's most respected healthcare group to work for 2013. And the nominees are Sun Pharmaceutical Industries Limited, Grand Baxi Limited, MCure Pharmaceuticals Limited, Dr. Reddy's Labs Limited, Siefler Limited. And the winner is MCure Pharmaceuticals Limited. Next nomination, please. India's fastest growing company in contract manufacturing 2013. And the nominees are United Biotech Private Limited, Medrec Limited, MSN Laboratories Private Limited, Hetero Drugs Limited, Uncle Drugs and Pharma Limited. And the winner is Ecom's Drugs and Pharmaceutical Limited. Missing out. Can I call Mr. Prasant Kalba, you know, who has been the trophy partner to get a small appreciation from Mr. Mayan Gandhi? Creative awards and rewards. Do you have the All right, in fact, uh, so many people are waiting stuck in traffic. Now I will request Mr. Mayan Gandhi to give his chief guest address. There. Namaste. It seems everyone is very tired. Can you have a loud one? Namaste! Namaste. <laughs> Should I speak in English or Hindi? You have been hearing English lectures all day, right? Okay, English then. At the end of 2010, I think I had personally come to a conclusion that this country is only made up of cops. They're all dead body lying everywhere. So much injustice, so much poverty, so much corruption. So many criminals in politics. A politics of hatred. A politics of different religion, different castes, different languages and nobody had the guts to stand up and speak anything. And I felt that this country may koi chance nahi hai abhi, kuch nahi hone wala hai. And suddenly the movement 
with anna ji leading it happened things started changing in 2010 there was no hope that anything is going to happen to this country suddenly today we are standing on a threshold where tomorrow the aam aadmi party is going to come to power a lot of good people in this country came there were people who were saying ki are half a percent of people are coming forward i used to feel at least half a percent is coming i i like to look at the glass which was half full so people asked these are good people but can they ever form a government so tomorrow we are forming a government the next question they will ask is well they have formed the government will they be able to govern if rabdi devi can govern arvind kejriwal can <laughs> trust me the next 6 months you are going to see a government that this country has never seen before if you think those water ch- promises and that electricity promises will not be fulfilled you are in for a surprise aam aadmi party has surprised this country again and again and again nitin gudkari called us a chiller party congress did not even like to refer our name all of you are for a surprise and a very very pleasant surprise i promise you that there is a third challenge third question okay these guys have one this guy can rule but is it a regional party or is it a national party i hope to prove we all hope to prove that this is going to be a national alternative till now we used to feel that elections can only be one the wrong kind of people using money muscles and divisive agenda 